Name one thing we underestimate about men. That they spin the block to seek revenge, whether it's your first time knowing them in your subconscious mind or you have history with them. Men cannot handle rejection, whether you know you rejected them or you don't. And my experience has been there been men that have followed me years ago or knew me in high school but I didn't know of their existence because they weren't on my radar and present day they'll try and get to know me I'll allow them to pursue me and then they say little things that make me go what the hell kind of resentment statement was that and then they let me know oh yeah I used to follow you men spin the blocks so that they can seek revenge on you and play with you and you wonder why they treat you the way you do and the men that you have history with do the same exact thing they are only spinning the block because they didn't figure it out or set with the idea she really played me and made me feel away i got something new for that ass and they come around with a new agenda and a new motive to fuck you over we underestimate that far too much what she's saying is so true it is so true to understand why we spinning the block you got to understand the nature of a man this is not nature to hunt it's in our nature to conquer. It's in our nature to create challenges for ourselves. So if you reject me, now you just gave me a mission. The mission might be to seek and destroy, or the mission could be to seek and make you mine. Think about how many love stories you've heard where the chick was playing games for a long time, but dude just stayed in the picture until the right time came, and now they're happily married with a whole family. It's the same thing. Now, I'm gonna be real with you. I'm gonna be real with you now. It's some dudes out here that create immature missions missions for themselves you feel me so the mission might be to really just fuck you and violate you and hurt you based on how his pride was hurt when you turned him down now i'm gonna be real with you my my version of spinning the block ain't going after joints i used to want in high school this is definitely not that my version of spinning the block it's a lot deeper than that because me and my stepmother we didn't have like a strong relationship but my stepmother was one of them women who took pride in putting men in their place you know what i'm saying she's one of those strong sister soldier type of women so for me when i was like dating girls i wanted a challenge and women like that pose a challenge for me so a lot of the girls I used to go after were joints that I felt wouldn't give me a chance. And that was my version of spinning the block, going after girls like that. To be to be honest, to be honest, it was more so me battling my childhood demons. Like I was literally going after these girls to conquer my childhood demons. And that's why I was saying like sometimes a dude might spin the block on you and then you might just get caught in the crossfire. Them shots not meant for you.